These black beads are not made for your butt. Spray a little clear coat. These are the messed up ones. Made a bunch of these bracelets for no reason other than I wanted to. Last week I smashed my YouTube button. It just felt right to break it. I got into 3D sculpting because I thought it would be fun. And it was a lot of fun. Leveled up by buying my own 3D printers. Just kept printing the same thing over and over again that I designed. And then I was like, ooh, let's try resin 3D printing. I didn't know what I was doing, but I was just documenting making stuff. And then I started getting better. I guess resin printing at the time was pretty new, so not a lot of people knew about it. Whatever I was 3D sculpting, I was just printing them. And then I was getting criticized by a bunch of 3D artists. I don't know what I'm doing wrong with my sculpts. I'm just sculpting, having fun. My friend Ben is boy in space got the hookup, so I got these bamboo printers. Any cubic reached out, sent me printers. This was all amazing. Honestly, I still didn't know how resin printing worked that well. I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just doing. And then a bunch of 3D printing people start criticizing my stuff. I'm like, damn, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just doing. Started printing parts for my motorcycle with tough resin. And then motorcycle people start criticizing my stuff. Besides social media, life was pretty hectic at the time. My wife was going through dangerous major surgery, but still making uploads while at the hospital. Art was just a way to escape life a little bit. So it was easy to do every day. And then I got into like farming and a little bit of solar power. And then I started getting criticized by indoor farming people. My stuff didn't make it. Everything died, of course. Seriously, though, I have so much fun making things. I love unboxing brand new printers, reviewing them. I don't know what to look for when I'm reviewing printers. I just talk about what I see, what I like, my first impressions. I'm not trying to come up online trying to be an expert on everything. I'm not customer service. I just like making things. All of the support from y'all positive people have been super amazing and so wonderful. But I guess we're at a new level here. People are going out of their way trying to let me know that I don't deserve anything good. Sometimes it triggers old memories of being beat all the time as a kid, but I take a minute, take a deep breath, I remind that part of me that's triggered, and I say to it, hey, we're making things to inspire other people to make things. I'm so appreciative of all these companies that wanna work with me, but I wanna let everybody know that I'm not chasing anything. I'm not chasing that YouTube button. I'm not trying to chase the hundreds of millions of views. I'm not trying to chase fame. I'm not trying to chase wealth. I just want to make sure everything that I create reflects how I feel inside about myself. Creating art is a spiritual thing for me. The more I heal, the more better creative ideas pop out more easily. So yeah, 